think about it. Everybody got it. Standing at the top, got the whole world around me. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Hey, put your stuff down and uh, when you're ready, get in the half circle. My name is Jeffrey Columbus and I'm the head coach of Diamond Bar High School All Male. The All Male division consists of teams of all boys between 4 and 15 students. It's hip hop, so it's going to be intense. It's going to be really physical, energetic, acrobatic, athletic. So it's an extremely cutthroat division. Timing, timing. I don't care if you do full out, I want a timing right. We've won nationals the last you know, five years. It's not easy, but luckily my boys are taking it seriously. I got it. <laughs> <laughs> That's almost there though. I don't got it. My name is Lewis and uh, I'm a junior. Uh, this is my second year on Diamond Bar All Male. My age 10, I started watching Diamond Bar and I'm like, wow, this is really cool. And I went on YouTube and I basically watched some YouTube tutorials and I went from there. <laughs> Let's go. Oh! <laughs> With our honesty, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna start dancing and maybe I'll get girls, you know, like homecoming, prom, whatever. I started finding out that it wasn't like that, really. I don't know, maybe it's just us, but I still hope my dancing will eventually get girls. Oh! Alright. Evan. Evan. Evan, you're early. You're early. Four and so four is only the right foot. Four and. My name is Jason, I'm a senior, and I'm the captain of Diamond Bar All Male. Being captain is a great responsibility. There's a lot of pressure to match our predecessors. Tap, 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 Each and every year, we have so many different teams trying to get that first place championship out of our hands. But what we do every year is we always change the game. Every year we choose to do a theme, and I think that's what sets us apart. That's what makes it Diamond Bar. Other teams, they're amazing dancers, but it's just that I believe they don't stick to the theme. Like, it's just hip hop, you know? We come up with so many different themes, and at the end we settle for one, and we have to commit to it. Five, six, and seven, eight, one, two. Oh, still off. Lewis. I just want it right twice. Once to get it right, and the second just to make sure it wasn't a mistake getting it right. Most of our team is made up of like seniors and they're leaving next year and I'm going to be the only one that's going to have like the three years experience and that really scares me, you know, because if I want to be captain next year, I need to work on leadership. One, two, three, four, and five, six, seven. seven. Is that supposed to be a ripple? Okay, that was off then if that was not supposed to be a ripple. It looked almost like a ripple, which is kind of cool, but if it's not supposed to be a ripple, then it was completely not cool. We, we've won nationals, but there's also all the mini competitions beforehand that lead up to it. Every week, there's a different competition. There's also that priority of bringing a performance to the audiences in a fall dance concert. So it's kind of like a, uh, a, a semi-struggle to maintain because we want to be ready for nationals, but at the same time, we have other priorities that we need to focus on. Do you feel like this is too hard? And it's pretty energetic, especially in the beginning of the set. Like the team is like five-year champion, but uh, we are not, you know, like our new team, we're not the five-year champion. We're basically like a brand new team. This is probably going to be the hardest section of the whole set just because it's pretty complicated. But we're, we've, been, we've been stuck on this section for like three practices now, which kind of sucks. And it's only because the timing is off and I'm not really happy with, with how it looks. We want to drill it into our bodies because muscle memory is a lot better than brain memory. And seven. All right, let's do that whole that whole section. The first time that I started coaching, we got second place, and that that became sort of like the driving force. Like second is cool, but no one remembers second place. Six, seven, eight, seven, da, 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 da. cool. Since this is my first year on Diamond Bar All Male, there's a lot of pressure and excitement and a lot of hype. Maybe Should like, I be like facing out? Because I'm still facing out this way. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that looks better. I've only known Jeff for a short time, but he is always throwing us energy, critiques, and choreo. 
that's way above us, but he knows that we can get it. The first year I was on the team, I thought he was just a coach, but like I didn't know he actually danced. But I thought I was only gonna coach for a year, two years, but what I didn't realize back then was how easily you can fall in love with the students and how addicted you can get to watching them grow and learn and improve as, as dancers and as, and as people. I started dancing when I was five and I started at a dance studio, tap dancing and jazz dancing. All my classmates, they all made fun of me saying that dance is all for girls. I'm also on the football team and I was a little bit nervous to tell my teammates because I wasn't sure how the way they react. A lot of people told me you can't make it in dance, dance isn't gonna get you anywhere. But I just ignored it because at the end of the day, it's about what dance does for you and how you feel when you dance. You guys have been doing good so far. I mean, I'm, I'm not displeased, right? But I think the mentality that you guys have is that, oh, I messed up once, right? I messed up once. And that, like, let's say that all you guys messed up just one time in that b-boy section, right? But when 11 people mess up in one piece, at one time, that's 11 mistakes within like a 15, you know, 15, 20 second period, yeah? Zero mistakes. That's, that's the goal. Zero mistakes per person for three minutes. But you have to put the work into it, yeah? You, ha you guys haven't won yet. What Jeff usually says, like, perform like you've never won before. Mm. Dance like... Dan dance like you're hungry for it. Knowing that other team, they're practicing every day just to beat us, that's why we work harder and harder. Boom, cut, boom, cut. Right. Diamond Bar is coming strong this year. We're not going down without a fight. DBHS! Hey guys, thanks for watching Brahma Beat. And don't forget to subscribe to Awesomeness TV! <laughs>